and uh, procedures also, how to use it. Huh? So we go one by one first, we take out the TPA. I will ask some question, not very big this training, maybe two, two minutes for each item. Huh? TPA, what is TPA? Anybody can tell me? Um, TPA. Very good. This is thermal protective aid. What is this used for? This does it? For? Cool. 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 This temperature uh, is going down. Yes, correct. This is used for the people who are having hypothermia or body temperature goes below the normal body temperature. What happens when you rescue somebody from water, maybe water very cold, like Cape Town area. Very cool because it is close to your the ice area. So the water is very cold, you have rescued somebody, maybe your own friend or maybe other sick friend, his body temperature goes below the normal temperature of the human being. So what happens? Once the body temperature goes down, your heartbeat starts slowing down, your blood pressure reduces. What happens is because of the warmth, the heat present in your body already escaped to the water. That's why your body temperature goes down. To maintain your body temperature, once we pick up this guy from the water, we have to put him in this type of suit called anti-exposure suit or TPA. Normally this is TPA, anti-exposure is different type. This is TPA, thermal protective aid. It will prevent you, prevent your body temperature. It will not let your body temperature to go out once you are, you are inside this. So the main purpose is to contain your body temperature. Normally it is provided with a full body suit, one suit for whole body except face. Face you, you will be here, it is same like your jacket, normal jacket but leg, hand, everything should be inside and your only face outside. Then what happened? Your body temperature, your whatever the body temperature inside, now it will start escaping out. It will contain within this uh, suit. So slowly, 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 slowly your temperature become normal. And then extra what you can do, if the leg, you, if very cool, you have to cut the leg part and give him the small massage on his foot to bring his temperature faster. Hand and foot. These two plays very important to bring your temperature up. Okay. So this is thermal protective aid. Remember this thing, it uh, very good condition. You have to check every time, no broken, nothing. This part of is checking every time. And second thing, jeeps we have to check. Uh, I'm talking about maintenance. Third officer is doing that one. And this jacket, don't think that uh, it is like once you wear, you cannot move. You can move, you can jump in emergency. So it is tested for that purpose. As per SOLAS and the LSA code, it is tested for that purpose. You can jump from 4.5 meter. You can walk, you can run also. Okay? In emergency. In emergency. And if you put this one in fire for two seconds, it will not burn. It is, you can call this fireproof also. If somewhere fire, you have to pass, you can just pass. You don't need to worry that it will squeeze out more. You have two layers. One is for thermal protection, one is for like fire protection. It is tested already. Okay, so first equipment TPA done. Now next LS, uh, LSA item is SART. Bring out SART. <coughs> SART. Madhusang, what is the full form SART? Very good. Search and rescue radar transponder. SART, this is used only Whatever I am showing you, this only in the distress type of condition. Never use in normal condition. This is all for distress only. What do you mean by distress? Distress means you have abandoned your ship, you have a threat of your life. That is called distress. When you give mayday signal, normally mayday means you are going to die. No more survival techniques other than this, that is called distress. You have transmitted some signal that your ship already sunk or you are in great danger to your life. Not about cargo. Huh? Cargo danger we can maintain, but life threat that is called distress situation. So this one used only when you are in survival craft, when your ship has sunk, you are already on your lifeboat or your uh, life raft, and you have to carry the signal. Both boats, one man must have duty to carry, bring this one from the bridge when you are abandoning the ship. Once master give you order to abandon the ship, one guy have duty of port, one guy have first starboard. This guy will bring this one together during abandon ship, real situation also. Once he bring, you already left your ship, already away from the ship. When you see other ship, within 6 to 12 nautical miles, if you are able to view, means visually see the ship, you have to turn it on, this red light lift and turn properly. Okay? Once you turn it, what happened? It will give you a signal on the other ship X band radar. X band, remember, huh? because frequency of this SART is 9 gigahertz 
and the frequency of x band theta is 9 gigahertz. So whenever it will give a signal, it is a just transponder. What means transponder? It continuously transmits some signal at a certain uh, seconds. Once this frequency is transmitted, it will hit the scanner of other ship radar and that radar will detect that somewhere we have the SART. So once that ship will detect the SART, what will happen? If the distance is very far, you will see on the radar small, small drips, dot, 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 dot. Okay? And for getting a good condition of the signal of SART, always X-band radar should be used in 6 or 12 nautical miles. Because on 6 and 12 nautical mile range, when you have selected on the radar only, you can get a good signal of this. That's why this X-band radar is very important as per SONAS. When this one sends signal, it will interrogate with the ship radar. Then you will see on the radar you have 12 bits. Every month we are checking this one. Third mate, second mate, they are checking that this is working or not. I will want to show you just small thing how it looks like. I have one picture, that's why I bring it. See here. This is the bridge, you see dot 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 dot. Like this you will see when the survival craft or the guy who is in the water is in somewhere far. Once you start getting close, this dot becomes small circle. When come very close, full circle. If anybody wants to see one month, one time when he will do, you can ask him second or third when are you doing, I want to see. Just go, they will start, you can see on them. Okay? Once you are getting close, this dot becomes arc. When you come more close, become full circle. That means you are already near the survival ground. Okay, so see this, this is the ship, this is the rescue helicopter and here your survival craft. So once you activate here, even he can see, even he can see. Because these people, they have the homing signal. You think maybe they have the radar, they have radar plus homing signal. So this SART having 9 gigahertz signal, they also have homing signal indicator. Once 9 gigahertz coming, they can see, oh this is the 9 gigahertz. That means somebody have operated the SART, he is in danger. So they will come to rescue him. Okay. Now one more very important thing, anybody know how much battery this not, without battery cannot work, right? What is the battery capacity? I will ask one by one. Huh? Chala ka. Battery, how much it will work? Let's say you are already in the, uh, the survival craft, you activate. How much time it will work? Wrong. Fifth. Fourth. Anybody? Except third officer. Three minutes? No. Remember, there are two times. Same like your phone. Remember, I am giving you very good idea huh? how to remember. Your phone, when you are using, battery consuming more fast, correct? But when you are not using, just charge and put, it will go to three days. Same like that, this battery also have two types. One is standby. When you have not switched on, not activated. When you not activated, it will run for 96 hours. Remember, huh? 96 hour on standby mode. But when you have seen some ship and you activated, ship is maybe 12 miles, slowly coming, coming. It will work for 8 hours and then battery finish. Remember, that's why I want to show you. Whenever you have, don't just go and activate. When you see some ship nearby, then only start this one. You have more chances you can get saved by other ship. But you switch on, once you go inside boat, you switch on, after 8 hours finish. Then what you will do? No, cannot indicate. When ship also passing, you cannot do anything. So you have to use it very smartly. Yeah? Same like your phone. When you are checking signal fast, when you are running, searching signal, doing some internet, battery going very fast. Same like that. 8 hours, stand by 96 hours. Okay? Done. And here one thing is given, I think everybody knows this. When you go inside the boat, you have to keep it a little bit high. Then in the canopy, there is one pole. You can put this one like that. It will ever height. When height is more, the distance for the other ship to detect this signal will be far. When at sea level, clear, maybe only half mile, the signal will go. When you increase the height, it will go far. That's why they have provided this system. Okay. Okay, the second one done. Now third, EPUB. Next question. This is related to everybody. Very, very important. I will ask question with nothing. What is the full form of this e -pub? Very good. This is beacon. Remember, beacon means a thing which gives you some out signal and you have a special signal which will drive you up to the air. Okay? 
EPUB, emergency position indicating radio beacon. This is only used in emergency. You don't have to carry this one. This always attached with the ship. When ship sink, for the investigation people to find, they want to find the ship and their crew, they will use this system. This system not sending any signal to ship, not sending anything to near post station, nothing. It is only connected with Cospas Surside Satellite direct. In our earth, there are plenty satellites, more than 24 Cospas Surside Satellites, which are geostationary. They are located at North Pole, South Pole, East, West, North, South, for five directions. And their speed, you cannot believe how fast. They move with the speed, one earth round they can do in 100 minutes. 100 minutes full earth round, one round, very fast. So this is very important equipment to find the survival people when some sick, some, you know, know sometimes message coming, one uh, passenger ship sunk in this, this location, how they know? How they know the location of the ship, how they are going to find out and salvage the ship, bring the ship, extract out. This is the reason. This is the reason. How it work? Now everybody know EPA board, correct? This is not sending signal to near ship, rescue board, no, nowhere. Only to the satellite. These satellites, they are connected with land, earth station and RCC and MRCC. Once the signal goes past our satellite, we get, it will transmit this signal to the land, earth station. What information? How they know this is Kota Salamat EPA? This EPA is registered with flag state and all over the world with this EPA belongs to PIL, MMSI number this, the name of the ship is Kota Salamat. Every EPA on the earth have separate code. This code only known by flag state and the RCC people. One of the Cospa Sasa detect oh, ting, 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 some special code, like, let's say bar code or some code. This code when go to Cospa Sasa, they know that this is Kota Salamat. No Kota Surya, no Kota other, only Kota Salamat. Because this code is registered for this thing and this MMSI number. So once Cospa Sasa will get the signal, this signal will transmit to the land earth people. Land people say that this this is the frequency of this signal. It works on 406 MHz. 406 and 1 to 1.5. These two signals, whenever you find anywhere, it is for survival position. This will give you only two, three information. No position, nothing. The position, how the ship will get this position of our ship? By using Doppler effect. Doppler effect, anybody know? This is the relative motion between two ships, Doppler shift effect. What happens? When the satellite gets signal of this ship, they will give the signal to the land people. Land people will give signal to the rescue boat. Rescue boat gets signal, okay, this signal coming from this position. Next position, maybe they are moving. Again, relative change. The boat is approaching towards you. Again, the cosmos satellite will give signal to the land. Land again give to the rescue boat. Okay, this signal coming from now this place. Slowly, 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 they are coming close and they found your ship. How it works? This is the position. technique, how this people work. Okay, so this EPUB is connected with HRU system. On board, you have three HRU system connected normally. Anybody can tell me which which items on the ship connected with HRU? Was any one item? Life raft. One very good. Second, EPUB. Just now I told you. Third, who will tell me? Who will tell me? You will get some reward from the PR Porta Salam show in Singapore. Nobody. Nobody. <laughs> Okay, no problem. It's okay. PDR. PDR capsule on the Monkey Island that is also connected with your HRU because nowadays plenty accident happening, but they don't know what is the reason. So they put a small capsule. This capsule have data recording for the ship maneuvering, RPM, how much, speed, how much, and this, what is the course, what everything recording. So that capsule, if they found with the help of HRU, it will go out. They can find what is the reason why ship sunk, why this accident. Happened. So these three places, huh? remember, your uh, life raft, people, and third one is your PDR capsule on the monkey island. Okay, so I think everybody knows now this, huh? and one more thing, if by mistake it is activated, you have to cancel the message by sending a message to the RCC nearest post station flag still, if you by mistake activate. How to test? There is one test button. When I press test, these two white will blink, you see. After that, don't worry. This means it's okay. If no, no white light two times like this, that means not okay. Okay. This every month also they are checking second of and third of. This battery how many hours? This battery 48 hours working. Once in one time activity. 
but this is direct to satellite so no need think battery finish no finish once satellite gets the signal it will automatically start transmitting that's why i say if by mistake activated there is separate test button is separate activation you have to remove and push the button so once they get this information they will sure come to because if of nobody neglect this is a very important equipment for sending next one is line throwing apparatus lte everybody know this thing i right? think yes okay normally some ship have like rocket launcher some ship have like this box this not very this is used for what okay fifth this have this long line through some other ship very good line throwing apparatus what means when you want to throw some line to some other ship maybe you want to rescue your ship you have to pass some tug line or you have to send some line which so that they can tow your ship maybe tow your survival craft life craft it, it is the distance is some far So how you going to say? You cannot. Nobody here can throw 400, 300 meter heaving line, correct? Only 100 meter also. I don't think so can send. So that's why they provide every ship. How many pieces are four? Wrong. Four. At least two pieces or at least four. Wrong. Anybody else? Three. Who who said this one? Ah, it's very close. How many? Four. 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 Requirement as per solar geo should have at least four line throwing and provide. Maybe one you throw miss, second throw miss. So they know that we are human, so they give four. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, here we are not the shooter, correct? We are not going around big shooting the gun. So we don't know. Maybe fly here, wind is strong. How we know? So this is very important. You see, I want to show you something very important. See what you can see only the rope, correct? Right? Inside nothing, right? except this rope and one trigger. Okay. Same like at home, sometimes you throwing this rocket, correct? Right? It is like that. When you activate this one, this side up, turning one. Right? When you throw this one, it will go very far. With the uh, line will go like rocket. Once it go to the other side, there are some techniques to throw. I tell you, everybody know projectile, no? Right? When you want to throw very far, you have to go to 45 degree. Once 45 degree, and other thing, the wind direction. If wind coming from this side, you have to go little bit toward wind. Because if you throw like this, and you want to go to this sugar, maybe you throw here going to the lucky because of the wind. So when you want to throw sugar and wind from this side, you have to aim toward chipko. Throw, fly, and go to sugar. This is the way. Huh? I'm just giving you idea. This, that's why they give four because you don't know how much speed. You are not Einstein. Not the calculator. So just approx, throw, throw, throw. At least one time you will hit, and they will take your line, and they will tow you to the show place, or they will tow you the towing line, or anything. You want to transfer from one ship to other ship. This is useful. This is instruction. Requirement is all the LTA must have instruction how to use it with the diagram. Okay, and procedure how to launch it. This thing. And one very important thing I ask everybody know have the rope. What is the length? Okay, give give some little fast fast. Huh? Ah, this guy already saw. <laughs> How much? Oh, third one. Two five zero. Two five zero should have, but it always given more than three hundred meters. Okay, so don't worry. So that means you have some ship. Two three hundred meter also you can send. Okay, so that's all for this. No, that's not coming. Okay, so everybody know two thirty to fifty meter the length of the rope. How to use? What for use? Sending the line. That one is name is line throwing apparatus. This apparatus is used for throwing the line. Next one is hand flare. This one hand flare. This hand flare. You know, everybody when you have some festival, we use this one for lighting. Sometimes marriage time or something. This is same thing, but this is approved. So large registered. This is approved. Hand flare means you have seen somewhere. Ah, no, no, no. Now we are posting here. Or on the bridge. There is one poster. How to use this hand flare? Ah, this hand flare is used to only to show that your presence, location. This is solar's already approved. It cannot be used for any other purpose except for safety of life. Tell me what color when I activate this one. What color it will be? Red color, not orange. 
रेड कलर ओके रेड कलर हैंड फ्लेयर अंटिल वट टाइम इट विल एक्टिवेट
So that is the three pyrotechnics. And now, very important thing. What is the quantity of each pyrotechnics? How many pieces this one should have in the light bulb? Two in the There is very remember. Two, four, six. Very easy. So two this, four is rocket parachute, and six is hand flare. Okay. Two, four, six. Finish. So para para techniques finish. Now next one is uh, smoke signal done. Okay. Now we go for the fire fighting one. Bring the EBT. Here, here. Just three more, and then finish. Five minute more. EBT. Okay. I want to because this one we every time we are doing and using. Ah, EBT. Ah, no problem, no problem. EBT. What full form EBT? No, no. Emergency escape breathing device. Remember the name as per the name source emergency escape breathing device means this one used only for emergency. When have fighting fire, don't use this one and start fighting fire. First important thing, emergency escape. You see how many minutes? It can go maximum 15 minutes only. So why this is used? When you are in cabin. Third officer, ring the general alarm. Already fire. You still sleeping? When you wake up, you have to find where is the location of EBD to run away from the accommodation. Only used for escaping. Run away. Run away from the smoke area, fire area. That's why they give emergency. So what do you have to do? You have to put in your neck. Now your hand is free. Correct? You can walk. You can run. You can hold something. You can do some. Open the door. All purpose. Your hand is free. That's why they give this strap. Okay. Next thing, you see, according to the EBD regulation, you must have the picture uh, instruction. How to put, where to use, how to put. You see, and then run. This is four step. Put on the neck. Put the mask, face mask. Start it and run. It is always in the green color. Huh? You have before using must check the indicator so that is in green color, not in the red color. It's already finished. So once finished, we have to, we can recharge on board also. So 15 minutes working time used only for emergency escape. Do not use for fire fighting. Location. Tell me how many pieces we have on board. Anybody who will give me accept accept you because yesterday I already told you how many pieces we have on board and where is the location. This is important. You don't know where is the location. Where are you going to find a runner? Nobody know. Okay, in general, how many? In general, people. Total should have nine. This is the requirement. Three should be on deck. Six should be engine room. Eric is hundred percent correct. So six engine room, three on deck. Engine room people they must know which deck, which is the location of EPD. On deck, where is the location? One is on the bridge. Everybody doing work. Other two? Other? One more no? Remember, no see Bob is no fire station, safety locker, and bridge finish. That one is for training, I think. One oh, this is for training. Okay. So remember, ah, total nine should be on board as per the solar requirement. Six should be in the room each day, and three in the ex different different place in the accommodation so that you can run away. Okay. So if you do, anybody have any doubt? <coughs> Next, two VHF. Bring it out. After that, we will go for uh, fireman outfit and finish. This two way VHF. Now we have a special one. Everybody know every ship is provided with the extra battery and two way VHF. This why called two way VHF and why it is not like our cargo was black color. Was there any difference? You know? Anybody know what is the difference between these two? No. What is the difference? This is also working. Okay, that is also working. Okay. First thing, this is Solas approved certificate. It will work, but that one no guarantee. Work? How much work? No work. No guarantee. This is Solas approved, and this here we have provided a various channel as per the frequency, and this frequency is more accurate than the your normal walkie-talkie because this one having 16, 70 DSC channel, all channels have, but normal walkie-talkie they will not give you 70 channel for sure because you start. Enhancing in between, so they will give you all the channels in this. But on that, you cannot have all the channels. First thing, like the frequency accuracy is more in this walkie-talkie than that one. This one two-way VHF, it is used for survival when we are communicating with other ship. So this is also requirement when you are abandoning the ship, you have to carry this equipment with you. So one for port, one starboard, one master. Three 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 pieces we have with spare battery. 
So spare battery also approved by Solas. Once battery finishes, you can change with the spare one and you can use it again. Okay, this is one thing. And uh, that's all today, which have nothing important. Same way. Some range difference also. Because this, that's what I say. This is more accurate. The frequency can go more far. But that one may be within the CP round. This one may be your 1 mile, 2 mile, 5 mile, still more. Same like your BHM. You may be Okay, that's done. Now we have one last equipment I want to show you because as per Solar, they are saying you have to done the BA set full, including fireman outfit in not more than how many minutes? Solar's requirement. Fireman outfit. Minimum two minutes, three minutes is acceptable. So anybody know less than three minutes, two minutes can done BA set properly without any help. I don't think so many party know from the procedure. Okay, so we just remove all this slowly, slowly other side. This is the last. After that, we are finished. Five minutes more, just eleven o'clock. Whenever this surveyor PSC they come, some say mostly in China, they ask this thing to please call your any one group and they normally call the Gali. Because they know Gali they don't know very well. So they call Gali. They want to catch. When they want to catch. So I want to just show you one time when they will tell you you have to done the BA set and fireman outfit together, you have to do two three things. The time for preparation of your BA set and fireman outfit is not included. Remember. So you can plan according to your style. This is not included in your two to three minutes. Okay? So once you plan your things, you know how to plan, you can wear within one minute also. I tell you. Just I will show you. Very easy. See, first remember one thing, fireman include everything. Not only BSA. Fireman include your helmet, your gloves, your fire axe, your line, your boots, everything. Don't say only this suit is the fireman outfit. No. Fireman outfit means complete set, including your line signal, including your axe, including your fire torch light. This torch light, do you know what is the cost of this normal torch light? $250. One torch light $250 because approved by solar, that's all. But light you see this bullshit light, you cannot see your face also. But because approved, that's why cost is $250, one torch light. We asked Last time. This is why you want this one. This cost $250. Okay, no need supply. Where's the torchlight, man? Okay. Where is the boot? Whenever they will ask you to prepare this, huh? You have to prepare the fireman outfit according to your style so that you can done it within the prescribed time of solar. See, when you wear like this, like this, it's very long time. What do you do? You have to turn this one like this and put your boots inside already. Bring the boots. After you put in this area for See, once your boots are already in, this preparation time is not counted. That's what I am telling you. This one, right side. Okay. Just, just for so. Okay, see, see, your boots are already ready and your legs are already here. Correct? Same like that. Here also. Just for so only. See, boots are ready. And you are already ready. Now you see, already save 30 seconds, correct? Because once you put this, and then this, it will sure it will take more than one minute. Now, it is like that, you see, kind of. Now you put, put your leg in the foot, already good and pants already ready. Second thing. <coughs> this thing is normal. Once down is done, this is same like your jacket, anybody can put like this very fast. Most important thing about this one, huh? once you've done this, you have a small technique to done this one. Huh? Always keep the face away from you, this nozzle. You put your hand like that, because you've already done everything, only remaining this. Put your hand, throw on your back. Very easy procedure. Wearing like this, very difficult. But you put like this, you turn, gone. Automatically on your place. This is the procedure when you save it. Fine. When it is emergency, you have to save everything. Keep it there. So one I show you, second, other one is not very difficult, put one torch in the hand, one axe, not difficult. These three important things I just want to show you. Now if anybody want to try within two minutes, you can try. At least one man should try. Fifth. <laughs> you are the who are interested. So you can't, can't keep it like this always? You, 
you can but when you secure very difficult like that understand you got no need to take out that is the preparation you have to do before when surveyor tell you okay you are ready you say sir no i am not ready let me get ready so you all do all these things keep one here keep one here this one front side this one here now you tell him sir i am ready what about you sir This thing you have to do early. This thing you have to do early. That is not the thing. Just one time, see open, clean. That's why this BSA all emergency things every week have to check by third officer. Every week. That's why they check. Anything less, anything problem, must be done or inform for the new one. Every week checklist is made. Third officer, fourth officer. We have three people now. Two more cadets coming. What they will do? They will do this one only. Checking the checking your LSA for your safety of mind. Okay, anybody has stopwatch? Start it. Let's see. No, just just one man. No other people. Okay, very good. Just prepare yourself first. Put all the things as per your requirement. Open the yeah, books. Everything clean. Okay. So that was that one only. Huh? That one. We count that this one you can do in 60 seconds. Just put the gloves and X belt. Okay. Any more time? Wait. One, two, three. Start. Okay. Do it. No, let him do. Let him do. Let's see. No, how much is really coming or not. And just notice where he wasting the time. Okay, so thank you very much, everybody, and please sign before you go. 